guys, the sunset just went down. I don't know if you can see. It's not really focusing on the sunset in the back. But it is so pretty. I don't know why I don't come to the beach more often. I literally live like, it's like, I don't know, like 500 feet down the street from me. It's like my backyard kind of, but I should come out here more often. It's so beautiful. And it's really nice outside right now. Like it's not even cold. You guys, this is what the snap light case comes in handy for. When you want to FaceTime when you're outside at the beach and it's pitch black. And then I'm talking to this weirdo. <laughs> just, this is the setup right now. <laughs> that is all. Today's dream outfit. Of course I wore this color and it's raining. So you can see all the rain on my pants. We are working out with my dad today. Look, we kind of match a little bit. We're hitting some shoulders. Alright, this lighting makes me look like an Oompa Loompa, but I'm not orange, I swear. Okay, so I just picked up a double chicken bowl with avocado, and I didn't get any sour cream on it, but I did get some beans and rice because I wanted some carbs. Hello, hello. But yeah, I'm gonna head to LA right now. I am an hour and 12 minutes away. So, I don't, let's see if that's correct, because you never know with LA traffic. LA traffic, people. All right, I asked you guys to send me questions right now, so I'm gonna answer some questions via the Snapchat. How long is a daily session at the gym for you? Good question. People always ask me how long I should work out at the gym or how long should you be there. It doesn't really matter how long you're there as long as you crush it. You don't take like long breaks in between your set. Take a 30 second break max and then just hop right back into it. Most of my workouts are about an hour and a half. An hour to an hour and a half. So you don't need to be there a certain amount of time. This one is from Dylan Miranda and she says, Hey Zoe, my question is what made you get into fitness? Well, I was teased a lot when I was younger for being skinny and I always got made fun of for people to be like, oh, are you anorexic or do you even eat? Or like, I literally heard it all. It used to like really hurt my feelings because I was like kind of shy and I didn't really stand up for myself much. And I always wanted to be like a little bit curvier and it was just so hard for me to put on weight because I have a fast metabolism. And that's kind of how I got into fitness. Like I was just like super fascinated that you can literally like build your body. Like you could eat more protein and that will help you put on more muscle. And also you can like work out a certain way to like help grow the parts of your body that you wanted to grow. Like, And I still see it on my thing. Like people still be like, oh, this girl doesn't even lift. But you can't worry about what other people say because I look back at my old pictures and I remember when I was 100 pounds or even smaller and I came all this way, I put on 15 or more pounds just of muscle and I've like learned so much in the process that don't ever like let what people are saying like affect like what you're doing. Like I know how far I've come and I've personally like made a lot of growth in fitness and just like in a lot of different aspects so that's why I really enjoy fitness. 
Hey Zoe, what do you do to stay motivated with working out and eating healthy? Sometimes it, there are days where it's hard for me to just get in the gym because I'm just like, oh, I'm so tired, I'd rather just take a nap. But then once I get myself in there, I'm like, so glad I did because I end up having like a really good workout. So, always get yourself in the gym. All right, I can't say this person's name, so I'm just gonna show you. Okay, that one was a dirty one. We're not gonna show you. All right, we got a video. Hey Zoe, how do I get sponsored like you did? Oh, okay, that's a good question. How do you get sponsored? If you're looking to get sponsors, definitely use, take advantage of social medias. So turn your social media into more of like a business page. What I did was like, I kind of just removed all of my pictures with like family and friends and I have like a separate profile that I post all that stuff on. Companies are always looking for how many people are gonna see their product and they wanna see what kind of interaction is going on in your page. So just really focus on trying to grow your page and post really good pictures. Like you have friends take good pictures of you. How old am I? You guys have to guess. What's my favorite cheat meal? Hmm. I don't know. I always crave like cheeseburgers and fries, but Augustine.gs9, what is your favorite baked drink? I am obsessed with lemon drop. Because it tastes like soda, it tastes like a Sprite. All right, thank you to everybody who sent me in some questions. And let me know if you guys want me to do more Q and A's or what do you guys want to see more of. Always let me know. We're just over here giving everybody the free workout game. It's my Ozzy. We're back at it again in the LA land at Chesterfield. Oh yeah. And I made a new friend. This is Jess. He came all the way to come say hi and get some pre-workout games. All right, so I'm gonna get my body scan on this thing. I haven't done this before, so let's, it's gonna be interesting to see what it is.